I'm Daly. Hi, I'm Eden. Welcome to Patera College. We're at Desail 3 School with 381 students and 33 teachers. Let's take a look. Current number of active panels, zero. Let's look at some of our current teaching and learning situations within our school. This is just so frustrating. I'm working with my senior drama students, so it's high stakes stuff. They're working on assessments. So we film them rehearsing so they can watch the playbacks because they need to look at their facial expressions, their body language, look at what they're improving and they can't actually see it properly. So I feel like I'm letting them down. They got frustrated. And 21st century learners, come on. It's hard to tell my face character definition if I can't actually see my face character definition because it's that dim and dark with that projector. It's really bad. How can we know what to improve on if we can't see ourselves? It's, it's really, really bad. It's bad. So Jasmine, what's wrong with your Chromebook? It's broken. And can you do anything with that? No. So will you have to buddy up with someone with a Chromebook that works or? Yes. It's not working. Not working. Your mind breaking. Way charge. And does this, does this happen very often? All the time. And how does that make you feel? <laughs> Angry. Uh, annoyed. Annoyed. Why? Why annoyed? Um, so I can't do my work. We would aim to base the active panel in our library slash learning hub. The active panel would actually um, allow for more of our students to be in the room and uh, using the technology. Uh, at the moment it's quite cramped and they get around the antiquated television and it just seems to be quite clunky so an active panel would be of a great advantage to our library, our learning hub. What is the number one technical problem faced by teachers in their classes? Easily uh, projector and audio issues with the cables and issues with the projectors being too dim, cutting out, audio not playing at all, all sorts of random problems that just keep happening with the projectors. So is this across all subject areas? Yeah. Definitely, yeah. Um, and are the problems easily fixed or is it, is it like, so when you said cables, can you sort of like explain why the cables? Um, sometimes the cables just break on us and they stop working, other times they don't sit in the sockets properly and they just stop working. Well, there's, everything's pretty much adjustable, it's all there, it's interactive, students can come up and do their work on it or have teachers be able to fully interact with it and it's all on one isolated unit. Lastly, let's hear from Isabel, who has been lucky enough to get hands-on with an active panel at the Interface Expos. We have always come to this Interface Expo for the last two years, me and Vienna, and we've always seen the latest technology that can be in school, and we've always been really attracted to the active panel just because of how big it is and just how much work you can actually do with it. It was so cool. could help me in school through business studies as through when you do minute meetings through every business and it's so cool because you can actually just go on there show what we can do throughout the years what we've done and everything and this is how we can improve on and just show it on the board and like push it and it can go to another document or something it can go onto the internet and you can draw things on there with all your plans and everything it'll be really good to use well we have chromebooks in school but they're really slow and really tacky and the keyboard is always like sticky and it's really hard to like always go on to like a different document and everything and it's slow i just don't like using chromebooks where this active panel will just be so much easier to use but the main thing, we, we really want um, you guys as students to be able to um, be up from your seats, not just always in front of your own device. We want you to be um, working together and collaborating together to make awesome stuff. My last year in school, because I'm going to be year 13 next year and I just really want to use it. It'll be so fun to use. Fingers cr crossed that we can actually have one.